Tom Phyllis from Marrickville in Sydney and son of an army dispatch rider started racing bicycles but abandoned them for motorcycle trials, grass track racing and scrambles, now known as Moto X. Aged just 20 and already married to Betty, they jointly bought a BSA Gold Star. But a two-year-old Manx Norton let him show his form better at the Fisherman's Bend track in Melbourne, such that a year later in 1958, he and Betty sold up in Australia and headed to Europe. Competing against international greats such as Jim Redman and Mike Halewood, he won the first World Championship Motorcycle Grand Prix for a Japanese brand and he gained Honda's first World Championship, the 125, in 1961. The same year, he was second to Mike Halewood in the 250 class and he was the first to lap the Isle of Man at better than 100 miles per hour average on a pushrod engined bike. In 1961, Phyllis won six GPs, four 125s, two 250s. Like Keith Campbell, Phyllis died the year after becoming world champion. For Phyllis, it came at the Isle of Man. He'd taken third in both the 125 and 250 races over nearly four hours, but then crashed and died in the 350 race. His death so upset the defending 500cc world champion Gary Hocking that he immediately retired from bike racing. We welcome Tom Phyllis into the Motorsport Hall of Fame.